We'll start our exploration by building the first 3D solid, which will be pentagonal prism. So we have a pentagon and square. We join those shapes by hook to loop, loop to hook, like that. And we then build the prism. So here we have a pentagonal prism. Now, the first question that I ask people is to give me instruction how to build this solid um, without giving the name of the solid, just instruction as if somebody was on the phone, for example. And usually I get answers of, you know, how to build it. You know, you put pentagon, you use two pentagons, five squares, you put pentagon, attach squares and attach another pentagon and so on. A very good instruction. Uh, but I would like to introduce a different way of looking at this uh, pentagonal prism. And to do that we will examine the vertex. Uh, what shapes, what polygons come into contact in vertex? It is two squares and one pentagon. And it is in each vertex. There are two squares and a pentagon. So now, if I were to give this instruction uh, to somebody who cannot see me, I would use, uh, I would uh, say something like, please make a solid that has two squares and one pentagon in each vertex. The person who, was, who would be doing that wouldn't even necessarily know what they were building and only by finishing they would know that they built pentagonal prisms. 